Hello everyone, it's Benny, and welcome back to yet another update video. Today, I have three things I want to talk about. First off is Let Him Dare. Second is some slight changes to what I'm doing. And third is sort of a surprise. So first off, Let Him Dare. As you may know, I participated in Let Him Dare, and I did a live stream of it. But then I mysteriously vanished for the second half of the competition. At some point after I finished my part two of my live stream, I realized my game had officially reached the doomed status, as in there was no way I was going to possibly get something decent working in 48 hours. And in case you're wondering, here's what it is. Your, these dots were eventually going to be planets and such, and you can fly around and you can pick up other planets with giant lasers and you can connect them. And you can use, yeah, any node can connect to build, to expand your laser network, and you can use them to destroy things by just running into them. Or possibly connect things, or, I don't know, I can do a few different mechanics with the whole laser thing. But the challenge is, if you, you cross a green thing, yeah, it breaks off that part of your network. Except, it also causes a stack overflow. And sometimes it causes a recursive object addition, and it just causes a whole bunch of really weird errors, those green things. And I could not, for the life of me, figure out what was causing them. So, yeah. I did not finish my game. But it's still on GitHub, so you can download and try it out for yourself if you want. And the reason, I think, why I've ultimately failed is because just lack of preparation. I knew it was going to be a 48-hour competition, I knew there was code allowed, or you could use code that was written before, but, well, I didn't really take advantage of that, I just sort of winged it. And that was not wise, to say the least. <laughs> so, yeah, that's why I think I failed. And I'm going to try and do better next time. But that leads me to my next point. I do want to participate next time because, hey, I had fun with this, and I'd like to actually finish a game. And, well, I just said I'd need a little bit more preparation. So I'm going to be starting a little bit of a side project that I'm going to call the Dare Engine, just as a code name for now. And I'll come up with a real name later, but the code name is the Dare Engine. And it's basically just going to be a 2D game engine built using the sort of concepts I talk about in my videos. And I'll try to live stream most of its development. It'll be open source, you can use it for whatever, but yeah. And there's a few reasons why I'm doing this. One, of course, is to have better thing to participate in Let Em Dare with, and to give you access to the same thing. But also, there's a few other things. For one, I want to experiment a bit with some acceleration structures like quad trees and oct trees, or maybe even BSP trees or something. And I haven't had a good place to do that yet, so I think this is a great opportunity to, to just sit back and experiment a bit with that. And also, acceleration structures are a very useful component in a well-designed physics engine, so this might affect how I do the physics engine series. As a result, I think I'm going to sort of put the physics engine series sort of on pause for now, just because we're getting pretty close to the point where we'd want to use an acceleration structure, and it would really suck to implement the acceleration structure I think I'm going to use, which is octrees, and then all of a sudden I do this side experiment and find out, oh, oh no, octrees are actually going to be horrible for this because of this new thing I discovered, and yeah, I just don't want to be in that situation. So I think I'm just going to put that on pause for now, make the software rendering series my main series for the time being, and after I've done all the experiments and such, I'll come back to it. So that's the plan. And yeah, so that's really all I wanted to cover in this update video. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned. And I'll see you hopefully on Wednesday, where I'll be live streaming some of the Dare Engine. And that reminds me, I'm actually not going to be uploading a v video, or normal videos this week, mostly because I just wasn't prepared for it. Let Him Dare took up a lot of the time I'd usually use to record new videos. So, uh, 
yeah, I'll just mostly be focusing on live streams this week, and hopefully by next week we'll be back to a normal schedule. And there. So with that, thank you. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned. 